Uh, which side are you going to be playing for? And for? <laughs> yeah, West Coast. Um, we're, we're very privileged to be in this position to ha have the game over here. As, as Sonny said before, um, I think the most, the majority of the Indigenous boys in the AFL are, are from WA. So for them, it's um, it's a great experience the whole week. But also to come back and play in front of their, their family and friends is um, is an awesome opportunity. And for us to be a part of that, um, you know, we're pretty proud as well. How big an opportunity is it to play against such a quality opposition in the preseason? Yeah, massively. Um, I guess this time of year you're, you're playing scratch matches or intra-club games against each other um, and, you know, we normally make the numbers up with, with waffle players. Um, but to play against, I guess, all AFL players, all elite players as well, as um, as was touched on earlier, there's 70 odd blokes to choose from, so it's a pretty healthy squad and to pick, you know, the best 25 players from that, um, you know, we're, we're up against a pretty good competition and, you know, you've seen what they've done in recent years against other teams. Um, you know, we can't wait to to get that match fitness in and play that game. So ahead of the Carlton game, Nick, it's probably probably would be good preparation for the start of the NAB Challenge, eh? Yeah, it is, especially uh, in this weather. Normally it's just running laps and, um, you know, just another training session. So to, to actually have a game, have something to look forward to um, is a bonus for us. Normally you're pretty, you know, you've been nursed through pre-seasons the last couple of years. You'll be, you'll be out there fit and firing? Yeah, fit and firing, so putting my hand up to play. Um, our boys, our Indigenous boys at our team as well are excited. So um, whether they choose to play for us or play for the All-Stars team is, is still uh, I guess in the balance, but um, you know we can't wait for this opportunity. Is that each individual player's choice? Yeah, it is. I think it's a different story to, to I guess the Freo boys, um, Sonny, that have to play for the All Stars team. But for us, I think they have that, that opportunity um, to, to choose. But um, I guess it comes down to where they're going to get their game. Just on the uh, the talent involved, there obviously you could have potentially an Adam Goods, a Buddy Frank, or Seal, Patrick Ryder. Um, pretty good warm-up for the regular season when you've got the likes of them running around. Yeah, it is. You know, there's a lot of big names in there, a lot of stars, a lot of established players in the AFL, and uh, to play against those guys is, um, you know, no better training run leading into Carlton. So um, I also look forward to playing alongside some of the boys I played with at Waffle level. So I think it was our Colts team a while ago. It was myself, Michael, uh, Louis Jetta, Chris Sharon, Jeff Garlett, all on the same team. So to actually play against those guys again, um, all, all at the same time, all being the Oval uh, on Subi Oval together again is. Um, an experience I can't wait for. Do you guys get to catch up much regularly as a group? Uh, not regularly, no. We, um, I guess we'll, we'll touch base whenever we're in town. But um, yeah, to, to actually all be in the same spot at the same time is, is pretty rare. And um, for those boys to come back and, and to come back to Perth, I guess it's another opportunity to see their family, whereas you know they only get the off-season period to do that. Pretty special for you to take on Sonny and, and Chris Yaron if he plays. Yeah, it is. So um, yeah, a lot of those boys, you know, growing up with with the boys and only playing against, I guess, one of them on the field to, to have them all out there at the same time. Um, you know, especially when you all grew up on the same street. Um, you know, it's 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 back to Perth. So we're encouraging everyone from our area to come down and, and get behind the game. Anyone upset? They're going to miss One Direction. At the <laughs> There's a few boys. They bought tickets, so um, yeah, unlucky they're going to have to come down here and play or, or, or be in the stands and watch and support the game. <laughs> Nick, Nick, any idea outside of just this game how much of the preseason you're going to play? Yeah, I'm not too sure. We haven't really sat down um, and, and gone through that yet. But um, yeah, our aim is just to get through and get as much game time in as, as possible. Do you want to play as many games as you can during that challenge? Yeah, I do. But um, I guess to a certain extent, to, just to be smart about it. And um, you know, the, the real reason we play is for, is for round one and, and from there on. So um, however many games I need is, um, is what I look forward to.